Institute, congrats to Irving class of 2021, have a safe summer. Wow, took quite some time to get here. Left for it like 10, 29. Now it's like, I think 11, 29, so yeah. But I figured that I really wanted to come here. Canada it is, so it is anyway, even though it's gonna take a rather long time. Explore that circle there. Usually you see these in like elementary schools, but this time it looks like this is also there. I don't think I see anybody sitting around there, so I'm gonna come out to the front. For a while, would there be anyway? Most people are probably at home barbecuing by the lake or something. And I thought about going to the lake myself. Yes, today is Canada Day, so should acknowledge that Canada turns 153 years old and that I also say the indigenous peoples also matter very much and that I do care about them, you know, especially with the recent events that have been happening with them finding out their bodies in residential schools, yeah not cool it's very soaring the families are upset so i would acknowledge that that's a very hard thing to go through and deal with so now that i've said that i'll make my way around here looks like they're working on something of the sort up here what exactly i honestly have no idea I really don't. Or is this something for the elementary school they're doing? I, I, I don't know. I really do not. But perhaps once I get up there, you ought know, to have a better look at it and find out. No, you know, okay, I see some cages over there, so that means that they are actually doing something for the high school too. Or maybe both it looks like, because I thought it's summer. Seems like they're probably renovating both. I don't see anybody walking around the track, but honestly, that's a good thing because with nobody around the track, that means that I'll probably be able to explore it. I don't know. Why am I even going here, actually? Because I normally just like to. This is the shop class area. Yeah, this looks like the shop class area. Maintenance vehicles only. I think I need to keep it the more harsh. I think, I'm not sure what they're doing there, but maybe they two are just exploring it. Actually, it kind of looks like somebody's holding something up, so I wonder if they two are actually doing something similar. And if they are actually getting photographs of the building, then that might... Actually, no, no, I'm not going to say it's the first time. No, it's absolutely not, because I've actually seen that happen before at... I forget the name of the place. It was somewhere close to some drive, and yeah, actually, yeah, there are people walking on the track. For a moment, I thought, hey, a big empty track. No. That's not going to be the case. Would have been kind of cool. Probably might still explore it anyway. I don't know. I'll see. Depending on where they go. If they're heading towards the elementary school, then yeah, I'll probably explore it. But if not, then I don't know. It just depends on where they're going. But even if I were to explore it, I would probably have to make it a separate video. I don't know. Or would I? Or would that not be necessary? I'll see. I'm 
I'm sure those parking vehicles are for a restaurant or if they're here for the recreation. Uh, yeah, I don't know. No, it looks like they might be probably heading there, so I might walk around it just so I can get a feel for it. Or maybe there should be something that I actually do after I complete the so no, I wouldn't say the circumference, that'd be weird. I'll just say the perimeter of the building. I kind of want to walk around it now, so I'll see how that goes. So what are they doing? Uh, I don't know. They're gonna play in that field. Maybe I can. Maybe I can't. Doing things like that is that really even, even all that interesting? Actually, I think I'm gonna do it anyway. I'm gonna just at least walk up the field and just. Actually, I'm just gonna walk it in, regardless of who's there and what order. I'm just gonna do do what I want to do because you know what. Who cares? Like seriously, why do I make such a big deal about it? Like honestly. Like some of these videos I think I make way too big of a deal about that. And that's proven in the Ajax High School video that I did, which wasn't uploaded to this channel. It proved that honestly, it really, really was not that big. Okay, no, I think I'll actually go clockwise. Yeah, I'll start clockwise. Yeah, I'm gonna go clockwise. Because I'm going Counterclockwise would be counterintuitive. Okay, okay. Honestly, it wouldn't match it, but for me, I'd rather just go clockwise. Now, you might be saying, okay, what's the point in walking this mundane circle? Well, the point is actually that by walking the circle, I'll get additional views of the area and sites that I can potentially explore afterwards. So, it might seem a little silly. But that's just about okay. If that's a sprinkling pad up there, I might have to be careful with the camera because that might look kind of odd to see somebody walking with a camera and a sprinkling pad. So I don't know. Maybe just maybe I might consider cutting across. Actually, no, no, I think I'll just continue as this again. I don't know why I'm making such big deals about silly things like that. As long as I don't actually look directly at them, I don't think they're gonna care. And even if somebody does say something. All I simply have to say is, it's not about you. What I'm doing is actually just going around the track, talking about the track, and talking about the neighborhood. So yeah, I'll just roll with that. If the commentary in this video is awkward, then whatever. I'm just keeping it real and honest about certain things in the past, how I would just be weird about, I don't know, the tracks or things like that but this time it's like I figure if I'm gonna be coming this far then I need to be getting as much coverage as I can within this neighborhood because distant places means that you need to make the trip worth it so if you're going far then you want to come back with a lot yes you do Okay, the elementary school is closer than I thought because when I looked at it on the map, they made it look as though it was way up on Dormington Drive. But then actually looking at it here, you can see that this is not at all the case. Now I see some guy in a suit sedan here. I'm not sure what he's doing. Maybe he too is going to more parish. I have no idea. But what I do know is that he seems confused. Again, I do not know. It looks like he's here to explore. Hey, right, so I'm gonna go on the track. Actually, you know what? I'm betting very, very heavily that if he does decide to stay, either A, he's gonna walk the track, B, go to the sprinkling pad, or C, maybe even just go to the restaurant. I, I don't know. I'm trying to even talking about this guy. Hello, well. Giving him more attention than he needs. I think so far since the start of this video, I haven't really given the video itself as much attention as I should. In fact, I think so far very little of my commentary has actually been about Woburn itself. First part of the video starts off about commentary with Canada Day, the indigenous and that. And then I feel like most of the this part of the video is me saying things about the track and some other things. But honestly though, what can I really say about Warburton itself? I mean, it looks like a fairly big building, but 
that's the thing though. It, it's like it looks big, but then actually walking around, it's like, hmm. It looks like one of those places that I could have easily actually walked around within like say five minutes or something. So well actually who am I kidding? Is it still big? It's still very big. There's no denying. It's just that some places have more curves and corners to give you the impression that they are a lot larger that they're longer to cover, but in reality they actually have about the same size. So that's that. Is that somebody chilling in the foot? No, I don't know. For a moment, about up there or so, kind of looked like there was somebody winching back in the bushes, but that's not actually the case. If it were, I'd be like, okay, that's a little odd, but whatever. Well, not necessarily. I mean, if they're just chilling, then I guess not, but yeah. Now up there are some restaurants, like around there, and are they open? I don't know. On my way here, there were a fair bit of places that were closed, but then there were also a fair bit that were open, some of which were actually really busy too. But of course, is it being Canada Day? Actually, no, you know what? It looks like there are a fair bit of vehicles there, so okay, I think look, the restaurant is open. Yeah, it is. I was under an impression that was actually closed, but that's not actually the case, so I eh, guess not everyone wants to take Canada Day off, so eh. But for me, I'm not here for the restaurant, so it's like whatever. Now, it looks like there's a garden up here. Is there a path that I can come down from here, or do I just walk? The yeah, there's a path, okay. So I don't have to walk straight through. A parking lot and I'd rather not because if I did I, I don't know it would just feel kind of weird I'd rather just be up here than to be in the middle of like I mean if I had to then I had to but if I do not then I'd rather not I think Mr. Graphics is clipped on here because if it weren't I'd have things stinging me and biting me and that which wouldn't be good but luckily for me that is not at all the case Actually, no, maybe I should have probably just went through the parking lot because the grass, though it looks clipped up here, I don't know if it's going to be for the parts of the, I mean, if it is, that's great. It looks like it is. So, again, that's good. And I think up there is where the sign was. So, if that's the case again, then, actually, no, no, I don't know what is up there. I don't know if it's going to be another, no, okay, it looks like it's a slight curve. So, to probably bring it back to the billboard yeah yeah that's the billboard over there now is there anything written on that rock because usually when you see big rocks that's lying around like that they usually have some sort of message of the sort so I wonder if that's the case for this one yeah it's very world looking kind of quiet yellow well we just will be busy but it's kind of day that's not the case and no there's nothing written on this rock and that will conclude this video of Warburn Collegiate Institute.